Alrighty, so we're back again. And yeah, you know what? I'm not actually going to... I know I said at the end of the last episode I was going to wait for this to happen. Um, but I'm not. But there are a few things I want to mention. Um, right at the end of the last episode, I started going back to minus a thousand, a thousand. That wouldn't be a, such a good idea because I actually came from minus a thousand, a thousand. So what I need to think about um, is I need to go basically to minus a thousand, minus a thousand. And then... Yeah, so once I get to minus a thousand, minus a thousand, um, yeah, I came from minus a thousand, a thousand, so that's there, there, and now minus a thousand, a thousand, now I'm going to minus a thousand, minus a thousand, so I'm going down like the left hand side here, um, so from there I'm going to want to go to um, a thousand, minus a thousand, and then I'll get to a thousand, a thousand, and then I'll complete the square. So, to, but the, but the point is now is I need to get to minus a thousand, minus a thousand. Okay. It's sometimes, yeah, I was just, what I was doing is just, um, just checking, uh, it's, it's nice to visualize these things, uh, basically in a, in a, in a you know, 2D sort of thing. So how is this going then? Um, so what is my current status? I've got no helmet and no boots. I've also got no wood. Um, all right, so this is not actually such a bad stopping place here. Food situation is also looking... Actually, no, it's looking all right. Yeah, so if you didn't watch the last episode, basically what happened was is quite early on I died. Um, and it was a frantic rush to get back my stuff, but I was fortunate enough to recover at least my diamonds. Um, which I will, I will look up that um, diamond one. I'll do that. I'll do that at the same time as I do my other stuff. I, I have a feeling it's something very simple. It might be something to do with the Nether. Um, so we've got yeah, okay. Cause we found those pigs as well, didn't we, last episode? So well, let's have a th think then. So yeah. Nice coloured wood, this acacia, actually. Um, if I ever do find this mesa platter, I might have to use it. So we didn't, we're not, we haven't got a crafting table. And by the way, I'm not, the thing about, I'm not really using beds, because to be honest, a part of this is to actually um, have a bit of fun with uh, um, fighting mobs and stuff. So of course we're going to need to get the rest of our armour. I would like to enchant our, the armour, really. Because the reality is, once you enchant your armor, it's very, very unlikely you're going to die. Um, unless you get a creeper at closer range, which doesn't really happen very often. Um, now a bow. Oh dear. Let's do it wrong. So you could do it two different ways, but not four. <laughs> which is kind of what you're hoping for. Alright. So, yeah. Okay, so we've got our armor. Um, I could make a bucket, but I'm not sure there's too much reason for it. Um, there's never really much reason to have full wood. Um, mm, in case you're sapling. Yeah, I wouldn't mind keeping my saplings, actually. Um... I mean, how, I mean, how, how well is this going to do for me? What if you could just break it and then put it on straight away? No, you have to have a hoe for that. Oh, well, I'm alright on food now, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. Um, but yeah. Mm, what should I do next now, then? I could make myself an axe. I do want this bow, though, so let's try and make a bow. Um, I've got 16 wooden planks. Any other trees around? Not really. Um, um, okay. So. I'm going to just go for this one. Yeah. Yeah, I thought I actually kind of almost do know a bit now, I guess. Of course it works that way as well. So that 
is not necessary anymore. I'm going to pick it up again, of course, such is life. But um, and we could have an axe. We can even have an iron axe, to be honest. Um, yeah. And I'll just make another spade, just because, uh, you know. Yeah, I changed these settings. I didn't know that for a long time that you could change it, so it didn't say shovel anymore. And yeah. But how can I aggregate these these items? Though? Um, an axe is not necessarily that important. I've got a saddle, so I could actually ride a pig off a cliff. Couldn't I? That would be the first ach achievement for a while. I'm going to have to think about that. Um, I'm not going to think about that really because I want to. I, I mean, obviously, the whole point is right is to get to the Mesa Plateau. This is not not going to be easy, to be honest. But all right, we're going to have to continue the journey, and the journey is towards minus a thousand, minus a thousand. So it's going to be basically in this direction. We're in we're in uh, dangerous territory here. There, I think it's worth it. <sighs> Fucking hell! I know it wouldn't have made much difference because I just did set world spawn, but that was a. Oh, I haven't even got a sword ready. That's dumb. It's going to be night before I know it. So I definitely want that. But to be honest, it wasn't such a bad thing losing all my inventory because, you know, well, I don't know. It's one of those things, I guess. I don't think I'm really going to need um, rotten flesh. So there's no crafting recipe. Isn't it? It's one of the mods you get crafting recipes for rotten flesh. Hmm. So we're going towards my, minus a thousand, minus a thousand. It's going to be in a straight direction this way. The blocks I've got are limited, to say the least. We've got one piece of dirt, which is not impressive at all. Um, and I don't think I'm going to be getting through it. Let's just um, get stacked. And actually, you know what? I'll do what I did last time, which is just to slowly progress over these things. One thing I will say is that when I'm in this kind of scenario, it's often um, a little easier to... Hmm. How many arrows? 12. And they're all from mob, mob drops. Yeah. Oh, I lost my anvil. Oh, that sucks. Well, I'm going to need so much iron anyway, and iron is just one of those things that you always come across. How am I going to get over here, though? I almost feel like it's going a different way, actually. Where's my um, field of view here? Yeah, I'm, I'm finding that since I, since I changed some of the settings last time, um, looks better. It seems better. Field of view, where is that? Is it in here? No. That's right there. 90. That's not bad. So we know we're going to minus 1000, minus 1000, which is quite a simple number to get to. Try and get through here. Yeah, so even if I go a slightly different route, it doesn't really matter. That's the thing. I think once you've got the um, once you've got the coordinates in your head, it becomes a bit simpler. Because all I really want to do at this stage is turn left. I can't because of the nature of this terrain. Uh, 
not necessarily the best thing to get wood in the middle of the night, but this terrain is actually harder for the mobs than it is for me. I may have even been to this area, I don't know. <clears throat> Uh, got Skelly out there. I might get some of these. These are nice daisies. Oh, full inventory already. Who are we looking at? Ah. What do you call that? Zomb zombificate or something? <laughs> Pow. Alright, so mine's a thousand, a thousand. Mine's a thousand, rather. Wow, God, stop saying it wrong. I kind of feel that. I uh, really want to find some clay. Clay's. I'm never that good at finding it. To me, that looks like clay, but it's pretty. It's, no, it's just stone, isn't it? They only spawn an ocean, I wonder. Oh shit. Where are they? Let me just check that I'm going. Minus a thousand. Yeah, I'm kind of happy with the way I'm going. I want to be veering a bit more to the left. Nice. They always put. They always um, face the same way. I'm not sure collecting flowers at the moment is, is that useful though. Oh. Um. Well, I think the sapling's not that useful. I could potentially use this as well as a. You know, last resort sort of thing. I can also get rid of this. Um. Ooh, shouldn't have let him get me really. Hmm, it's kind of a shame there's no way to blow up the uh, blow up it obsidian. I'm going to have to go down and get obsidian. Oh yeah, I was going to do the obsidian generator, but I don't know. To be honest, I'm not really, I can't really be bothered to do a lot of this stuff at the moment. I just, I just, I just want to play the vanilla game, because I haven't done it for, for, for ever really. Um, so minus a thousand, minus a thousand. Alright, we're not in bad shape. Let's keep checking for clay there. All right. Hmm. How am I going to get out of here, though? I'm not going to get any more wood for now. I think if I'm going to go underground, that's the only time I really need to collect wood. Because when you're overground, it's very little different. Ah! Flower forest. Yeah, I thought I'd be here. I wouldn't mind some torches now I think about it, though. Just because. Torches are always nice to have, even if not underground. You know, for instance, if I do this torch here, if I'm, this is a nice area there. This is a biome I haven't found yet. So where are we at now? Minus 900, minus 200. Yeah, I've got to admit, these flowers do look fucking cool, don't they? This is a good area, I think. Hmm. No, I don't want to stay around here too long. I don't want to ruin it. Oh shit! 
At least I've got my iron armor back. I should start using my bow a bit as well. I haven't even used it once yet. So which way do I want to go now? No. Looks good. This way. This is a fucking cool area. Looks like there's a massive cave there as well. But you see, the advantage with this is that by looking around all the terrain within the thousand block radius, because something that I mentioned um, in the last video, so I have to be, I really want to be in, in range of a stronghold, because there's no point going to like, even if I found a mess of plateau thousands of blocks out, you know, of course this is all based on the fact that whether you can even find the mess um, around here. I don't even need any more bone meal at the moment. Hmm. Nah. I'll be alright without it. So, we're on the way. And to be honest, this isn't, for once, a night has been... It's because I'm travelling through such difficult terrain. But for once, a night has been a bit more... Then again... Hmm. I don't know. I like that flower forest there, it's cool. It's because I was worried that maybe because I'm not in 172 that some of the biomes wouldn't appear. I am still a bit worried about the Mesa because that may not... I could be very unfortunate and they might have removed it from 171. But it was so close to the 172. We've got there. I know that's the wrong way though. Alright, so... Looks like we're doing all right. Hmm. So, yeah. Time for some more. Oh, wow. There's a lot of pumpkins there. Yeah, maybe I should put a sign down. Uh, have I got any sticks? No. Um, Where's the sign? Is it just six pieces of wood? Yeah, three signs you get. Oh, right, I've got no wood. Oh, actually, no, I still do have wood, actually. That's good. So I could just mention there's, there's pumpkins here. <laughs> um, you know, just doing a little, you know, just looks a bit weird, but oh well. Alrighty, so yeah, we've got an azure blue eight. Let's um, let's just replace that. So we've got a little too far now. I don't want to go into the pumpkin area. We're just in a regular... I mean, it doesn't look like planes to me, but it is amplified, I suppose. Uh, so, yeah. So, never get near an edge, I just think, hmm, should I do set world spawn? Hmm. Yeah, I knew even if I didn't make it, it was going to be okay. Food situation is still looking okay. Um, so yeah, let's carry on. I don't want to put the, I don't want to have the thing on the screen the whole time. It's going to be a bit annoying to watch. What is that? Hmm. Oh well. Now there, I'm not going to get through. So I'll just go around here, I guess. Yeah. 
Mm. Oh, it's pigs I was seeing. Yeah, I'll be alright without them, I think. I could potentially go up here, though. It's probably going to help me, actually, when I think about it. So let's get up here. If I can. Uh, some reason I get lag going up the waterfall. That's a bit weird. Should be alright though. Okay. Ooh, there's a village here. Maybe I've been here though. I may well have been to these areas, but I'm not sure. But yeah, I think the more sorts of things I put around. Huh. Yeah, this is, this is, I mean, that's the thing. Because you don't want to just completely go in a square. But, we'll see. There are a lot of pigs around here, but... I don't know. This doesn't actually look like a village that I feel like I've been to. There's quite a lot of dark areas here, though, so... It's not such a good sign. Let's just take care of this guy. Nice. <laughs> Let's clear this area a bit. Hmm. It's funny, they don't always get you here. I don't know. Maybe they get you? Yeah. They are pretty accurate. So from here I've got very easy, to, it's much easier to get them from below even so. Alright, we're going to be in night time soon so I'm going to want to vacate this area. Just curious, if it's any, you know, all the villagers are dead here. I think I have been here, you know. Didn't take the bookshelves, but oh well. Alright, so we're still on the way to minus a thousand, minus a thousand. We're veering off track a little. So we're going, basically we're going into the, the bottom left hand corner. Um, it's obviously looking at the standard X, Y axis. Oops, I haven't done that for a while. Yeah, it made a nice jump there, so... It's all right. Um, hmm. Mm -mm. Okay. Just want to find this Mesa Plateau. Maybe I can't. I am gonna I'm gonna actually look it up after this, I think. To see if it is actually does even exist in 171. I mean it could just be incredibly rare, I suppose, but I don't think it is that rare. Right, so we're getting we're getting we're getting to a pretty good level now. This is Birch Forest. Birch Forest, I think, was in extra biomes. Pretty sure, actually. I haven't found either a sand temple or a jungle temple yet. Is that actually what it's called? I need to check that out. I don't think it is called that.
Alright. Looking at Yeah, we're doing quite nicely actually. If we go in a straight line now, a straight diagonal line. There are some cows. I've got to admit, cows are nice and nice to kill actually. They're worth they're worth killing more than any other animal really. Alright, we can finally get rid of that. Hmm. Alright. Damn it. One of those jumps you always, you make every time parkour, but in the real world you don't. Am I picking up the leather? Maybe there wasn't any. Alright. There's definitely leather that time. I'm not picking up. So, get rid of that. So yeah, I, I'm sure I return to that um, flower forest area. Actually, um, looks like a good place. But you see, the advantage with all this is that you only go in a two thousand by two thousand area, which means it's it's a lot simpler to to work out how you're going to do things. And also, if you wanted to, if you wanted to. Uh, um, do a minecart all the way around the area, around the perimeter. It'd only be 8,000 blocks long, which sounds quite a lot, but it's it, it's not actually that much, really. Um, it's the sort of thing that would take about, you know, 8 to 10 hours to do. But yeah, while I'm killing these cows, I'm not going to do it. I'm, there's no point. I need to be a little bit more succinct with the... Uh, Print screen. Doing alright though, we've got seven pieces of leather already. Obviously we had some enchanted stuff, we'd be doing a lot better, but we don't, so we're not. Oh that's close. Alright, it's gonna be time to gear up for night time. Let's go in the right direction. It's not that way. Is this the right direction at all? Let's, let's go around here. We may not be getting that far tonight, to be honest. Because we're going to have to deal with mobs. And I think if ever I get to a point where I'm very low, I'm really going to have to try and end a pearl. And try and make sure the trajectory isn't such that it just makes things impossible. Okay, that's nice. But where now, I wonder? Hmm, getting a little bit un underneath where I want to be. Uh, fuck it, I can just build up with wood, I don't really care. This this stage I just want to get higher. I mean, think about it. this is cutting down. This is the same as cutting down four pieces of wood with an iron axe. Not going to be a huge deal. I just want to get higher, really. Once you get a bit higher, you can actually um, 
start go to season where you want to go. Yeah. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh yes. We've made it to Mesa. Oh. And it's direct and it's within the coordinates as well. Oh, that is so brilliant. Wait, is there two Mesas though? Is this Mesa and then there's Mesa Plateau? Oh, I've got, I've got to see this. Why have I even got clouds on? Ooh. Hmm. Oh wow! Seriously, I got a real, a real fucking shiver down my spine there when I got, when I saw the messer. That was that was brilliant. There seems to be a lot of it as well. All right, this this is very very good news because it means it means that this is going to basically be the real. This is actually going to be the base. No, no question. Ah, oh, does it go? Is it going to go outside of of a thousand? Minus a thousand, minus a thousand. So what I'm going to do for the rest of this episode? Oh yes, it's so fucking awesome! I can't even. Oh yes. What trees are these? I bet these are not the same. Ah! No, they are the same. No. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, that is awesome. That, uh... You know what? This is this is going to be my base, so I'm just going to make a chest right here. Oh, man. Awesome. Oh, this is so awesome. I cannot even believe it. Oh, man. Oh, I'm just going to make the base right here. Or should I make it higher? No, I think here is going to be a good place, actually. It's not far away from the flower forest. It's not far away from the flower forest. Let's just get this chest made. Where's my crafting table? I don't know, I even, know, I even have one. Uh. Oh man. I can't tell you how, I was, I was thinking, shit, I'm gonna be on episode 50, I'm not gonna find this fucking mess of play. And I was thinking, oh, I'm gonna have to walk around. Oh. oh man, this is fucking amazing news. It's not amazing, I don't have enough, um, for a chest. Oh, there's trees here though. Let's get a bit more wood here. Ah, oh, finally I can actually... And you know what, once I make a bed and everything around here, obviously I haven't got anything to do. I haven't really got enough resources. But once I do, I'm just going to... Let's just get rid of it. I'll just forget about that for now. You know, I'm sure. <laughs> I think I'll be running into gravel again. Yeah, this is a bit, it's a beautiful view of this bit as well. Yeah. All right. All right. So what I'm going to do is. Yeah, you know what? I, I, I This is so unlikely I was going to find this. I think. I think I'm just going to actually... Where is the moon at the moment? Where's the moon going? The moon's going down. Yeah. Alright, so... Let's just get rid of everything for now. So I wonder if I can plant some acacias here. That'd be interesting. Oh man, it's so cool to have this.
Oh, it's cool. I'm going to get every tree here. I'm going to make a big base out of all this stuff. All these new colored clays. Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, ye yeah. <laughs> anyway. You know what? This isn't even... I, you know what? I think it's even better than the plateau. The plateau would just be a straight... It would be a flat thing, wouldn't it? But this is just... This is literally the real... This is like the root of, of the Mesa. So it's even better. And it looks massive from the distance. But all that is going to have to wait until next episode. So until that time, thanks for watching.